Welcome to WCO TV. I'm Steve Winkler, the editor in chief of the Washington County Observer. Susan McCarthy is the managing editor, and she's in uh, New Haven, uh, Connecticut today, uh, enrolling her daughter in, uh, in the college they have up there. Seems like Susan gets an awful lot of vacation time around here. But I have to talk to you today. I got a memo from the executive board this week that's really concerned about our numbers. Our visits to our website are good, 6,500 every um, uh, 30 days or so, six, 7,000 people, that's real good. We have 22 followers on our Twitter. Uh, it's exceptional. We're very excited about that. We have uh, not concerned about Foursquare anymore since we realized that we have to have a, I would have to have a telephone that told me where I am, and I can't understand that, how it works. But the main, the number that's concerned the board is these uh, Facebook numbers. We have seemed to have leveled out, stagnated at 850 uh, Facebook fans. We need more. So we're asking our viewers to give us some suggestions, like many organizations do, that when we reach the goal of a thousand, uh, someone in the organization will do something uh, Silly. There's not going to be anything, you know, when we reach a thousand, I'm not going to uh, kiss a pig or kiss a donkey or I'm not going to do anything with farm animals. So contact your friends, tell them to go to the uh, Washington County Observer on Facebook and become a fan. And we will uh, see these numbers rise and uh, we really need your support on this. We need your help. It's, it's viewers and readers like you that make this all possible. Enough of that. Let's get to the good news. And it is right here. Washington County Observer, the ink is on the paper, Volume 2, Issue 15, April 14th, 2011, coming right out of South Washington County. Truck ordinance finally passed after a lot of uh, uh, debate and uh, delay over in Greenland. They have a truck ordinance that looks good for them. Uh, water loss in West Fork is still on the rise. They're going to have to bring in some experts. The water seems to be... Uh, blowing out of some holes in the pipes there somewhere. The Below the Fold story, the nice little feature this week, uh, is a continuation of those stories we've been talking about, the old cafes on the old 71. Uh, this one's riding in the 50s here. A couple of local ladies uh, who have uh, the real estate uh, shop down the street are looking at uh, their, their store. It used to be a, uh, a little cafe there, and they're making uh, milkshakes out of the old uh, equipment that was there. Nice story. Keep in mind the words of Dr. Seuss. Today is good. Today is fun. Tomorrow is another one.